replace the left uh, hand side front blinker for the Triumph T120 mine uh, was pushed I guess by someone and the nut came out of the housing which is just plastic I've tried to repair it uh, but nothing held so I've had no choice but to order another one they're not cheap and uh, what I got is is this that's the uh, the actual light indicator light with a uh, Allen head bolt that's got already some thread locker on it so let's go ahead and replace it and there are two little Allen head bolts one here and one on the other side and if you undo those the um, the whole um, beam uh, and light comes off There were some cables in there. You'll see the one that goes from the indicator, is this one here, goes around to the back and comes through the... Now I just traced it and it goes up to a little area on the top of the housing underneath this plastic cover. Now in order to get better access I want to remove the whole light assembly to do that, I'm going to disconnect the little switch at the back, which is this one here, and it just pulls out. Yep. So that pulls that pulled out from the back there, from here, and the whole thing now is just hanging on one little connection, which I can undo. Just that little connection there. It's just a single connector. just hanging there uh, or I can just leave it hanging like that because I think I've got enough room to work with just as it is so this housing is held by two screws I'll see if I can focus in on them there's one there and one on the other side and they are not your common garden variety screws there's this uh, And I got these in a kit. This little box here comes with a driver, and yeah. See if I remove this. There's all the connectors up there, and if I now trace from here inside there. And I can actually see it moving. These are the two connectors there. There's a white and a black cable. And if I disconnect those two connectors there, I'll be able to remove the whole assembly and then replace it. white goes to the green red cable and the black goes to the black cable so black to black and then the other one now I can now take this out through the back of the light housing Then I can remove the whole assembly, one cable at a time, one connector at a time, there's, there's one and two.
Yeah. I do need to remove that. To give me a bit of room. <laughs> And we assembly is just the reverse. So I thread the uh, cables through the cable conduit. One first and the other. I pass it through the back of the uh, light housing. And I'll come back to that in a moment, but I'm going to finish the installation, physical installation of this thing here and what we've got is same sort of bolt looks like an M6 that's got a bit of thread locker on it I'm going to put a little bit of extra wet thread locker just to make sure and that'll go in like that with a washer a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la república dominicana la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la república dominicana I've got the, uh, the two connectors that belong to the bike and then I've got the two that have come in with the new light, the new turn signal that's these two here and there's a black and a white and if I remember rightly the black goes with the black and the white goes with the uh, uh, red and green so Black on black. Dominicana, la casa del merengue, la casa de la bachata. La, 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 la casa del merengue. La, 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 la,